Hey guys, so, sorry, I wasn't sure if it was recording, it would be able like stop and pause, it was weird. Um, anyways, I am back again. I told you I was going to make more videos and I actually meant it this time because, see, the secret to sticking to vlogging is having other responsibilities that you're avoiding, such as, like, studying for midterms or finals, what have you. Um, by the way, that's just my music playing in the background. Ignore that. Or don't ignore it. Enjoy it. It's tame. It's awesome. Um, and that little noise you may be hearing, the sound like it's someone constantly taking a piss that is actually in my fish tank, so don't worry about that either. Um, speaking of piss, though, and yes, that is a really weird segue, but go with me on this. I've got this. <laughs> no, actually, it is not a jar of piss. It is, like, Wild Bill's Yellow Root Tea. And I have no idea what it's like, what it's going to taste like. Um, I had this assignment for English class where I have to go somewhere and then like describe the history and then describe using like, it's basically an excuse to try using different adjectives and creative verbs. And so it's a really easy class. Like our first, our first assignment was a rough draft of our intro paragraph. So that should give you a hint on like kind of how the class is run. I'm kind of scared to taste this because like what if someone just pees in jars and like slaps a label, like Wild Bill just pees in jars and slaps a label and be like, yep, yellow root, you know, like some freaky weird, like shake thoroughly, keep refrigerated after opening, drink four ounces per day. So this is 12 fluid ounces and it's water, yellow root, and citric acid. Yellow root has been known to have been... Yellow root has been known to have been used by people for many years. Mix with your favorite juices. I don't know if it's an instruction to mix it or like you're not supposed to. You, they also had like a, a minimum, like a $5 minimum for card and I didn't have cash because I haven't been making money. Buying stuff out of my checking which probably isn't good. Um, so I had to buy this and like I've had like royal honey jelly or whatever. Royal bee honey jelly. But I thought this was the same because it was two for one dollar, but it's actually, let's see if it'll, no, it won't. Anyways, it's Red Panex Ginseng Extractum, which sounds like Harry Potter spell. Red Panex Ginseng Extract a Honey Bee. Extract in a honey base. So I'm going to try both of these things. Um, There's just like an update thing saying, hey, what's up? Um, Groot says hello to, I am Groot. I know, I'm a, I'm a great ventriloquist. Don't, don't worry about it. Anyways, here we go. Um, so it's in a mason jar too, which makes it super sketchy because it's not like... Well, it's not... Because it's not like you can just like... It's so easy to pee in a mason jar. Like, not saying that I have. Although one time I was on a road trip and this dude peed in a bottle in the van in secret without telling anyone. It was disgusting. Whoa! Well, I had trouble opening it, so I used all my force, and then whatever juice this is just spilled everywhere, so <laughs> luckily for me, I had no homework on the table, but I've got, like, nice um, little drippage on my arm. Probably wash that later. Okay, didn't get on my planner. Well, it did, but not, like, really too much. And this book from the library. Oh. Okay, this this video is a train wreck. I should not have done that. I see. I thought once I started taking martial arts. Sorry, could you hear me? I was down there. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. In case you couldn't, this video is a train wreck. And in case you didn't know, like I thought that since I started taking martial arts, like halfway and Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, my coordination would get better. But like I still knock things over and run into things. Okay, well, good enough for now. The the show must go on, as they say. So, cheers. Well, it doesn't smell like pee. I, it tasted for like pickle juice for a second, and then it tasted like, like um, just like straight up lemons. So there's that. I'm going to clean this up after the video. Now I'm going to try some... Wait, you know, it wasn't that bad. Hmm. 
Mmm. -hmm. Lemon juice. Okay. And this, I'm pretty sure it's just gonna taste like strong and sweet. It has a really, that, that like lemon juice or whatever has a really weird aftertaste like like musty almost. Okay, so I've got the little straw and I've got a little thing. No! I bent the straw. Okay. I know you're supposed to do it this way because that's how I... You know, I'm gonna use my keychain. My mom gave this to me. It's super weird. So it has a hole so it's supposed to go on the keychain. This little blue thing. It is a mini touch knife, which is incredibly dangerous and a bad idea. Like if you accidentally like do that and you're like grabbing for your keys in your bag or whatever. But I think it's really cool, so I'm gonna get it anyways. And it's good for opening. It's very good for opening Red Panic Ginseng Extractum. I think. I thought I stabbed it. Oh, there we go. So let's see. Ooh, I like um. Honey, royal honeybee jelly a lot better. This is... It tastes like the bitterness of dark chocolate. A little bit sweet, but then immediately after, it's like a really bitter, strong aftertaste. Like you're drinking like straight molasses or something. So, I don't know. Um, I tried weird foods. I told you a little bit about what I'm doing. Um... I don't know, I have tons of adventures, I'll tell you about them sometime. Um, let me know in the comments below what you want to hear about. I can tell you about dungeons, I can tell you about nudism, or I can tell you about... What else have I done? Um, Topless Truth or Dare with two strangers. There we go. Also, um, I'm not sure if there's like still my friend from church following me on here, so if you're watching this... Shh, that was a lie. I didn't do any of that. I am an innocent. Do you hear my? Do you hear my? Do you see my angel halo? See, that's, that's the thing about these videos. I never know who's watching them, so I never know like how to present myself. But then I should always be myself. But then there's some people you shouldn't be yourself around because you don't want them to judge you. But then you shouldn't care about people judging you. But that's for another video. So take care, stay beautiful, and go out and adventure. That was a weird face. Okay, bye.